Hi, this is Unlimited Access. Hi, my name is Levi. Hi, I'm Shannon Ellsworth, CEO and founder of My Health Hatch. We have big news. Or, or. <laughs> <laughs> we have big news in the next yeah. few weeks. Maybe by the time this is even released, um, Ursa Men will now be our new name. That's U R S I. S A M A I N. He can't even spell her name anymore. U R S A M I N. I'm trying to look at it, you know, on the screen here. But so Ursa Men. Um, okay, we are going from my health hatch yeah. to Ursa Men. Yeah. Why? Why? Yeah. It's uh, so we. My health hatch is a great name. It was originally what we came up when we started thinking about what's the problem we're trying to solve thought about, you know, mom solving caregivers, et cetera. My health hatch was built. It was really just solving the medical records problem itself, this having your medical records. So we're like, hey, my health hatch, my health hatch. <laughs> um, what we've learned has evolved in that you don't just need your records. I mean, anybody can do that. You can spend some time and it's annoying, just like your financials, um, but you need your records to enable you to do something. So you know, why do I need my records? And we're going to ask that question. Why do you need your records? Why well, I need my records? Because I have a back problem and I need to go get a specialist who can help me feel better. I need my records because I, um, I'm spending a ton of money on all of this other stuff. And it's because I don't know what I'm doing. I need to go see my doctor and get some help. So everybody needs their records for a reason. And that's when we realized my health hatch, which was kind of a repository of your records, it really didn't symbolize the future of what we're trying to do. And we really wanted to reflect to our customers that we get your pain. You don't just need your records. You need your records to solve a problem. I have one woman that uh, her child is is very sick. I think her child's seven and she's like, Shannon, I just can't get her care. I can't get her care because I can't get in. The doctors won't see her until I get all her records because she's got a history and they aren't going to risk their, you know, they're going to risk making a bad diagnosis, get the records. So your heart goes out to these caregivers who need their records caregivers and patients need the records to either help their family save money, um, get to the right doctor, get to a specialist. So it was an action word where my health hatch was just more of a, hey, we store your records. So we also had a lot of questions from our investors as well, <laughs> where they were like, I don't get it. So you came up with this challenge. Yeah. You're so like, you came okay. up with this challenge. Okay. The three criteria that um, I remember were it has to be short, it has to be memorable. Yes, I did say and short. And it has to have meaning behind it. Yeah. Right. I wanted a fun story, a to fun be story. fair, because every um, every logo I've seen, we've always just we just got to get up and tell well, why the logo, why the name, right. and you always have some fun story, but it's also got a lot of meaning. And I did watch short, right. because I was presenting, <laughs> and I couldn't say my. <laughs> well, so uh, we looked at a bunch of different things, uh, not to go through all of them, yeah, and uh, we kind of got in this world of navigation. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Because it was we're fun. trying to navigate the healthcare industry is what our app. We looked for really for for yeah for words that that represent what you have to do to get yourself better and or your family loved one better. Right. So as we we did that and um, we found out um, or some minor right. Neither Ursa one minor. of us are navigators ourselves. We are not. <laughs> <laughs> so, Fortunately, there are smarter so people than us. We don't sell or anything like yeah. that. Uh, so Ursa Minor is Constellation, and that Constellation yeah. helps with navigation. And why don't you kind of just go from there? Yeah. So, yeah, okay. Um, Ursa Minor is Constellation. As you said, we're not Constellation people. I, I, I don't – I can't – should I say that I can't find Ursa Minor in this guy? <laughs> but what really resonated with me, and we had two different ways we could go, very literal with the name, um, or we could go it's symbolic and then – get somebody's really creative to, to look at what's the meaning. And once the constellation and navigation came up, it resonated so much because you're struggling to get through the healthcare system. And that's the word we all use. I just can't find my way. And if we had a map that told me how to get care, if I had, I say, if I had the instructions for my mom when they told us to do chemotherapy and I had a map that said, here's what's going to happen if you do that. 
um, I always ask for a map or write out instructions. So Constellation, all of a sudden was like, oh my God, that's so cool. Like you're trying to navigate and it's going to tell you how to, how to get home. So that's where Ursa Minor came along. And then, well, we can't say Ursa Minor. We wanted to shorten it and it became Ursa, Ursa Min. That's right. Ursa Min. Or Ursa Mine, if you like that. So we came up with that Ursa Min. Yeah. And uh, I, I think, uh, I know I fell in love with it right away. You did too. Yes. You, you, and we tested it with other people and they gave us positive feedback. And then we got into this idea of designing that out. Um, we looked yeah. at stars. We looked at boats. Boats, because um, we had a good story about fishing for record <laughs> off the ship was pretty fun. <laughs> that was pretty fun. Uh, but we settled on a bear. A bear with a star, but yes, the actual bear of the constellation. Um, and we loved the fact, Ursa Minor is the bear, and then looking at the star, which is very um, representative of the healthcare community. So one thing that uh, everybody's trying to do is bring the patient, caregiver, consumer together with the healthcare community, and you've got this big gap of knowledge and they call it the North Star, the North Star of healthcare. You're really trying to get the patient. Everybody is focused on that. We just, we just all it's struggle with it, two different kind of groups that you're trying to bring together that in a, in a way that's um, that includes both of them. So the bear was really indicative, I think, of of people and Mama Bear, and you've got Ursa Minor, Ursa Major, your parent, Ursa Minor, your child. Um, you could really start to build a story around the family. Mama Bear is very protective. Caregivers are really protective of their patients. I was screaming and fighting and threatening to sue everybody to get my mom help. Um, so the bear was really reflective of that piece of the caregivers. And then you've got the star, which is the healthcare system. And how do you, how do they help you kind of find your way home in that system? Right. And uh, so we did. We got a new logo. And uh, see if we can throw this one up on the screen. Here's our new logo here. Yeah. And um, we're also going to have a, a whole brand new name change and it's gonna be crazy gonna be, <laughs> it'll be fun no, that's gonna be so all the youtube channels and um everything is going to be uh, changing uh, unlimited access though that is still that's got to stay the same that's got to stay the that same. was that's that's just cool <laughs> that one is just really but, cool yeah. well um you know we're in beta we've got we the, are in beta the app is out we're yep you know again what would you like to tell the folks out there about um Everything. We're making a lot of big changes over the last month. As you hear a new name, we want to come out and resonate. We're, we're going to do some really fun marketing around the name so people kind of understand. When people really start to understand it, they have a lot of fun with it. The consumers are like patients. You guys are really important to our future. We can't do it without you. We don't think that um, we think that we're going to be different in that we really want you to be a huge voice of our platform. So join the beta. We made it really simple for you to hop in. Tell us what you think. Your feedback, good, bad, indifference, hate it, love it, anything, we'll take it. Um, and make sure that you are a guiding voice as we move forward uh, with our app. So please, please join us. Yeah, for sure. No doubt about it. Get out there. Sign up for the app. Um, test it. Let us know what you think, uh, what improvements we can make. And start to use it. It's, it's available for you to use. Mm -hmm. um, again, my name is Levi. Shannon Ellsworth. I hope that. Slash Ursa Men. <laughs> Slash Ursa Men. Yeah, <laughs> it's going to sure. be hard for it's a gonna while. It's going to be hard for a while. We're going to mess up a few times. Um, but again, like and subscribe to the videos. Uh, please join us in this fight. Uh, we believe that here at Ursa Men that if you have access to all of your medical information, your records, data, you're going to make better health decisions. And that's what we're fighting for. We're fighting for you and to help uh, you know, really improve the industry. Thank you so much. Like Thank and subscribe. You.